Hey guys, all quadrilaterals have something in common. Of course, they are all four-sided shapes. Squares, rectangles, trapeziums, all four-sided shapes are considered quadrilaterals. They all have a special feature. This feature is that the angles, the four angles in any quadrilateral add up to 360 degrees. Just like triangles, the angles add up to 180 degrees. With quadrilaterals, four-sided shapes, no matter what size, what shape they are, the quadrilateral will always add up to 360 degrees. Memorize that and you have no problem. Let's look at the diagram to understand it better before we do some examples. We can see that this is a quadrilateral. It has again four sides, which means it has also four angles. The angles marked with an A, a B, a C and a D. All four angles add up to 360 degrees. So the angle sum of a quadrilateral is 360 degrees. No matter what shape, what size. If it's a four-sided figure, if it has four angles, you know straight away it's a quadrilateral. The angles will always add up to 360 degrees. Let's do some examples now and understand the concept even better. Okay guys, we're now going to use the angle sum of a quadrilateral to find the missing angle in this four-sided shape. We look carefully and we notice that X is missing. This angle here is not available. We know this is 135 degrees. This is 65 degrees and this is 120 degrees. Altogether we know they add up to 360 degrees. So we can actually work out the missing angle by taking away all the other angles from 360, we're going to be left with the missing angle marked with an X here. Let's get started. Let's see how we work it out. X is our missing angle. It will equal to 360 degrees, which is the total minus the other three angles, the 135, the 65 and the 120. 135, the 65, and the 120. X is going to be whatever is left over. 360 is the total. Take away that, take away that, and take away that. We're going to be left with X. 135 plus 65 plus 120, we know is 320 degrees. Add them up in your calculator if you like. 135 plus 65 plus 120 is 320. So 360 is the total. Take away the other three, which is 320 degrees altogether. X is going to be 360 take away 320. X is 40 degrees. Now, what do we do? We write our reason. Our reason, angle, sum, of a quad. That's the short form. Angle sum of a quad, angle sum of a quadrilateral. That's the rule that we used. This is how we justify our answer. We are giving reason. X is 40. How did you find that out? Well, we used the angle sum of a quadrilateral formula, which tells us that all the angles add up to 360. Take away the three angles, we're left with the last one. 360, take away 320, X is 40 degrees. Angle sum of a quad, our answer is there, our working out is there, and of course, our reason is there. Let's do another example, hopefully you understand it even better. This example here, again, we notice it's a four-sided shape, it's a quadrilateral. We know straight away that M is missing. We're asked to find the missing angle, marked with an M. We can now use the angle sum of a quadrilateral formula to actually work out, just like we did here, work out M and find it over there. Let's start by writing M equals, so M equals the 360, which is the total, take away the other three angles. 
the other three angles are 110 plus 60 plus 90. So 360 is the total. Take away 110, take away 60, and of course take away 90. Remember this symbol represents 90 degrees. Very important not to forget that. M is going to be 360. Take away everything else. Take away that, take away that, and take away that. 110 plus 60 plus 90 is 260 degrees. These three angles add up to 260. Well, now M is going to be 360, take away 260. M is 100 degrees. So M here is 100 degrees. 100 plus 110 plus 60 plus 90 all add up to 360. M is 100 degrees, and of course our reason, angle, sum of a quad. Angle sum of a quadrilateral, that's the reason for our answer. We're saying that 100 degrees is the missing angle over there. How did you find that out? We use the angle sum of a quad. Quadrilaterals, no matter how big or how small, what shape they are, they always add up to 360 degrees. That's exactly what we did. And this is our answer. This is how to find the missing angle in angle sum of a quad in all four-sided shapes.